We've got to make sure to continue to use the the ward. <clears throat> Ooh, I thought they were alive. Ooh, don't stand like that. damage that was good uh, why are we dying why are we dying Okay, this guy is going to deal a lot of damage. Ooh, be careful, be careful, be careful. Don't get caught in that. A legendary relic. Cold penetration, fire penetration, lightning penetration. Let's go cold. Plus 5% all resistance is 3 tournament. 
8% increased mana regen, 13% increased cast speed with physical spells, 21% increased critical strike chance with physical spells, 34% increased stun chance with physical spells, 55% increased health regen, and 89% increased spell physical damage. Interesting. What makes a spell physical? I assume... Spell physical damage. Increase damage dealt by spells. So if we equip this, we were at 75. So nothing is going up there. I mean, what is this giving us? <coughs> Intelligence, necrotic, and fire resist. Why did we have this equipped? It's not very good. So, I mean, if anything, we're fine equipping this one for now. 55% um, health regen. Five to all resistances. I forget what attunement is again. Uh, attunement. Each point of attunement grants two mana and improves skills that rely on the innate magic inside of you and your surroundings. So that decreased our mana because this one gives us 23 mana okay oh is this the one that we had on no Oh, I'm so, so scared we're going to die. You know what? After all this, we haven't bought anything. I think, like, one thing. We're st only at 70,000 gold. It's like, it's really not that much. Increased cast speed with physical spells. We're looking this up. Because I don't know what physical spells are. I don't think that's us. I mean, you wouldn't classify what we're doing as like a physical spell.
Yeah. No, this is like druid, shaman, lich. Okay. We don't have physical spells. It's stuff like entangling roots, ice thorns, thorn totem, tornado. Doesn't really feel physical, but shaman, fury leap. Swipe. It's still better for now. Um, we lose a little bit of mana, but... The health region is nice. The resistances are nice. Looks like we got everything here. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. If you're in here. That's awesome. Adele Felix. Hey, what's up? How are you doing? We're not dead yet, so it's going about as well as I can hope. Uh, we were taking a lot of damage in that last area, though, and it's making me real nervous. <laughs> like, these enemies are hurting Like, we definitely do a lot of damage ourselves, but we're having to play very dodgy and aggressive at the same time. Ooh, don't stand in poison. Weekend plan, uh, so I don't stream on the weekends right now. Um, I'm using that time to just be with family, focus on, uh, we have a five month old baby boy. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm absolutely treating this like a nine to five job almost, right? And so, Yeah, it works. It, it works for us so far. I mean, this is my first week of full-time streaming. Um, so it has been an experience for sure. I can't even tell you what day it is. I think it's Thursday. Yeah, it is, it's, it's the only way I know it's Thursday is because um, as I'm saying that, I don't even know if it's Thursday. Is it Thursday? It is. Can confirm. It is Thursday. I um, I was thinking the uh, my wife and I were watching Campfire Cooking, uh, the new anime, and it came out on Wednesdays, and so we always got really excited about it being Wednesday. 
And so we were really excited yesterday, but then remembered that the season finale was last week. So now we have to wait for season two. And it's really rare for my wife and I to find an anime that we both love that much. And so it, it was a very sad, sad day. We are going to have to pause here in about 14 minutes to actually help my wife. Uh, she's heading out with our son, and I just need to help her get ready. So I will be gone for just a few minutes, but then back. How long have you been doing streaming? Uh, I started a little over two years ago um, doing some Magic Arena and had a great time. And then five months ago, so like right before our baby was born, um, I hopped back in and had an even better time, and I definitely want to wanted to pursue it. Um, there were some limiting factors and some things that just make that hard. Um, it's still definitely a challenge right now, but we're my wife is super supportive and super incredible, and we are trying to make it work. Um, because this is something I really want to push for. So, um, yeah, full-time streaming and then uh, also putting everything up on YouTube. Uh, so I have a channel over there, same name, MC After JC. Um, and, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting some views. I'm getting some, some likes and super encouraging. Uh, it's definitely slow to start, but... I'm really, really enjoying myself, so. And when people stop by, it makes me happy. So I'm going for a variety stream. Um, I am playing any and all games that I can. And uh, I had just seen some really, really good reviews about this game. And I think that those are justified now after playing and getting this guy up to level 40. I really, really appreciate that. Uh, more than you could possibly know. Um, but yeah, so we do a little bit of Core Keeper uh, from 3 to 5. Uh, just as a way to wind down from playing my first hardcore game ever. Um, which I am actually really enjoying, by the way. Uh, I knew Core Keeper was a good game, but I did not realize just how much I needed it in my life right now. And, uh, yeah, I think uh, there's Goat Simulator just came out on uh, Xbox Game Pass. And so I was thinking about doing some of that. I play uh, Minecraft a good bit, uh, and I've been playing Pixelmon, the Pokemon mod for Minecraft, lately. Um, so I've been told to show off some of the stuff that I've been doing over there, which I absolutely plan to do at some point. So, yeah, I mean, I have been playing video games since I was four. So I am happy to try anything. Uh, I am definitely willing to give anything a chance. And, uh, like I said, so far, oh, they did a lot of damage. Um, I'm having a great, great time with this. So, I'm both anticipating and uh, fearful of dying. More so now than I have been throughout this whole playthrough. Now we need to figure out what to do with this. Cost less mana, but the largest... Nope, not that. Give me... You have more time to stream and devote yourself to gaming. You can make a great living out of it. Yeah, that's the goal. I am so sorry you're not using creative and unique designs on your channel. I don't know what that is. Enlighten me. Ah, my moderator. He's the guy. Glacier has a higher chance to freeze enemies, but deals like, uh, we wanted to deal more damage. 
Glacier has an increased chance to freeze and stun enemies. Okay. Yeah, Epos. We need to we need to get on that. <laughs> and I appreciate I appreciate the feedback. Uh potentially. Obviously uh new streamer, no real budget per se. Uh my moderator does all of this out of the kindness of his own heart. And uh I'm very thankful for that. Maybe one day I can pay him. <laughs> Epos would like that a lot. Um, but, you know, always open to, to thoughts and feedback, for sure. Yeah, maybe we can, uh, maybe ePost, maybe we can work with them. I like them. We'll see if we can set something up. Is that, do you do that for a living? Yeah, do you have a website? Send me a Twitch DM, I'll look over it. Yes, talk to Epos. Like I said, he's the guy. For sure. I think we want to do that. Awesome. Yeah, if you can send uh, Epos uh, a DM on Twitch, um, he will absolutely, we can take a look and we'll, I'm happy to take a look. And uh, yeah, anything to help grow the stream at this point. Uh, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> absolutely. We're not picky about that yet. Hopefully we can be picky about that at some point soon. Um, but yeah, 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 yeah. We're just hanging out and... Uh, happy to happy to take a look. Uh, I think that's good right there. But let's go ahead and teleport back. I don't want to get too lost before I have to pause anyway. So, um, Adele, thank you. Seriously, that's uh, super encouraging, and the idea of sharing stream with friends is super awesome um like i said epos will take a look and yeah we'll let you know if, if there's anything we think we can benefit from and you know like i said without budget but we're definitely happy to always take a look um so i will be back don't know how long i'm just gonna pause stream i'm not gonna end it but hopefully 10 15 minutes so uh, if you're still here, Adele, great. Uh, I don't expect you to hang around for 15 minutes doing watching the screen that's about to pop up, but thank you for stopping by uh, and for the follow. I really appreciate it. I will be back. Well, I think that was close to 15 minutes, but I think we will go ahead and end stream here. I did it! Rip. You know, I, I, we're in a good spot where we just hit level 40. We just kind of went through our items. Uh, we can... Go through some of these items. I just accidentally talked to that person. We did get a crazy looking new staff. Welcome back.
let's let's show this. Okay, I will be done, but then I'll be back at three for not Pixelmon, which Eposts will be sad about. Oh yeah, there's Ruby. Hi Ruby. What are you doing? Look at that tail wag. I know, I know, we'll get to it, but I'm, I, I'm like craving to play Core Keeper. I almost played it off stream. Uh, definitely do that. I'll let you know when I want to do it, but yeah, I'd want to show off what we did there. More than anything. So, ooh, we got another one of these. Two seconds of stun immunity after using teleport. 4% chance to gain lightning ages when hit. Ooh, that's cold damage. But I want, I want lightning ages. Here's the staff we got. It's a lot of mana damage. It's a lot of spell damage. 58% increased damage over time. 112% increased lightning damage. Okay, yeah. We need to use this. <clears throat> That's a tier 1 lightning damage. That went all the way up to a tier five. If we can get something really good on this. Chance to blind on hit. Ooh, what is this one? Modifies the outcome of a craft when upgrading an affix. Prevents the roll of an affix within its range, changing when it is upgraded. Prevents the roll of an affix within its range, changing when it's upgraded. So I guess if you have a high roll tier 1, it'll stay a high roll tier 2, maybe? That's how I'm understanding that. Ooh, freeze rate multiplier, but chance to chill on hit. Tier 1, 33% chance. Requires level 42 to forge. 44. Oh, I thought we couldn't use it for a second. Okay. Ooh, that's the first time we've had a two-handed staff in a very long time. We're starting to get some really crazy stuff. I'm good with selling everything else. Um, let's go ahead and shatter this though, because we had a lot of stuff on there. Um, boom. Sweet. Put those in there for now, because they were decent.
none of that looks like anything we care about. Uh, nope. So, okay. Can we see what Lightning Aegis is? Oh, wait, no. It's gotta be a skill that I've just passed over. But anyway, all right. Uh, if you're watching on YouTube and you've gotten this far, you're lucky because I'm totally gonna cut out at least that last big 15 minute break. Um, but thank you. I really appreciate it. It really does mean the world to me right now. And uh, there's more to come. I mean, we haven't died yet, so. At this point, if we do die, we might just move on to a new game. Uh, we'll see. And Core Keeper in an hour. So, thank you so much for everyone who stopped by stream, uh, and see you soon. Until next time.